Alright guys, so here we go. Uh, let's get this down. So what we're going to try to do is we're over here at the Volcano Cave. I'm going to try to build a pace that's over the Volcano Cave but still has access to the Volcano Cave underneath. I figured we're going to be doing a lot of ascension videos and things and a lot of stuff in the general area. We've got the redwood trees over here and stuff. We've got the everything up to the north and everything. So we're just going to go ahead and build our base up here. I have a couple ideas for it. Uh, I'm going to Hopefully not have to worry too much. Um, we might have some combat music every once in a while just because of these raptors right here. Um, even though I've got... Oh, I don't have it on, do I? Oh, that's funny. So we have to kill this guy. Alright, I've got to put god mode on. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. Alright, so let's go ahead and get our build going. So, uh, basically guys, we are going to go ahead and we're going to start off with some foundations. So I wanted to snap them in here because I wanted them to be um, right about in this area. That's why I put those pillars down so I could snap these babies in. I do plan on doing a couple cool things with it, but I want to get a foundation base across the top and that's why I was hoping I did that. So you guys can see we're going to get a nice foundation base across the top of this. and It'll work out really well so we can rip up these pillars now and not have to worry about it. I was going to do the whole thing on pillars, but then I thought about how uh, the pillars on vanilla can get very goofy with support structures and stuff. So we're just going to go ahead and continue to build these babies right here. So let's go ahead and keep placing down a couple of our foundations until it won't let us place them anymore. My feeling is, is you can always remove things, especially since we're spawning things in. If you guys do this on your personal servers or private servers, you can go ahead and spawn it in. If you're not spawning it in, if you're actually getting this stuff, I highly suggest you do it in thatch first so that you can place it down, make sure you have it the way you want it, and then put it in because there's going to be a lot of building, removing, and stuff like that. So this is technically going to be our, I would say, back entrance to the base would be the best way to put it. So what we're going to do is I'm going to build a support structure coming out this way, plus down the sides. I want the sides to be like one side to be storage room, the other side to be like manufacturing or have them next to each other or something of that nature. So, and then the other side can be like dino storage and stuff. So I want to have a way in and out. Um, this is going to be a back entrance. I'm planning on putting a behemoth gate. I put in 10 foundations, it looks like. So we should be good for a behemoth gate to go down here. It's not going to be 100% symmetrical. We're going to change it up with some cool angles and stuff like that. So as I said, this is just going to be a cool build. So let's go ahead and start building. Uh, on top of it, I want to note, I am making it a, the best way to put it would be a two-story thing. So what I'm going to do, um, and I'll just kind of go ahead and start doing it and show you afterwards. So pillars can be very goofy. I love building on pillars, but at the same time, when you build them or you build straight pillars before you place these down to make them look pretty, pillars can sometimes give you support problems meaning the pillars won't show that they have a foundational support under them it's it's very goofy how it does when you try to level them off so what I'm gonna end up doing is you guys see how I've got this thing right here so what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna place these things like this so we're actually gonna stick them through I'm not too worried about it uh, overall so uh, we're gonna go ahead and keep getting these in here hopefully they're not sticking out too much which doesn't look like they are they're doing a pretty good job of staying into the the ceilings and not sticking out so they're gonna stick out a little bit we knew that but we're gonna make like a pseudo floor and I figured down there we could hide some stuff and make it kind of like a, a little thing uh, as I said I'm doing this as a tutorial base it's really in my tutorial world uh, however uh, it could have some fun uh, implications for PvP and stuff like that I'm not gonna just you know, not do it just because I know I can't get PvP done, but we're just going to go ahead and keep building. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and try to get some of these base structures down and underneath and everything. And uh, I'll go ahead and grab you guys after here a little bit. And uh, we'll bring you guys back once I've got the, the base down and everything. Uh, and we'll see you guys here. So those of you on the stream, um, I don't think there's anyone at the moment. Uh, but we guys can go ahead, keep up with what's going on. And we're just going to keep building here. I'm going to keep farming and building. And uh, you guys can see it from, from scratch to nothing. So we're trying to get these snap points to work properly, which they're not going to. Uh, they're very goofy sometimes. I had it. Come on. Do it. Put it down. There we go. Nice. I want to try to keep my supports in there. Do want to stop my recording real quick and keep streaming for a highlight reel yay so we're going to continue placing these things down i'm going to make them all the way around so they're going to keep coming um 
and as I said, that's going to be kind of our entrance would be the best way to put it. And I'm just going to keep building down like this. So we'll have to spawn some more stuff in here eventually, but this should be a pretty cool build, I think. I'm going to go some more. I'm going to probably get out a couple at least here. This going to be difficult, isn't it? I can tell. Oh, come on. I love pillars, but I hate them at the same time. Don't work with me here. Do what I want you to do. I don't want you on pathway. I want you down partway. Like that. Come on. That one's going to be the difficult one, isn't it? There we go. Got it. Nice. And then you just gotta talk to it. Just talk to it. Come on. Come on, go in. Go down. There we go. Just keep building. And there goes the wyvern. Decided that I uh, wanted to try to kill my wyvern and my unicorn. Not gonna end well for him. So that'll be fun. It's actually Deadly's Wyvern, is actually the funny part. Not even my Wyvern. Deadly's favorite dinosaur is Wyvern, if you guys didn't know. Ugh. Just got wiped. What'd you get wiped on, Juan? Are you talking about on uh, the dedicated server? So there's that. Um, we're gonna go one more, one more. Oops. One more. Don't be, don't be obstructed. Why are you obstructed? Stop being difficult. Things can be difficult the whole way. Oh my. I knew this was going to be a fun build. That's why I knew it was going to take forever. Take forever. Unicorn doing the work. Oh, yeah, that helps. <laughs> uh, I think I forgot to upgrade my settings on this to uh, five difficulty. All right, so let's get this one to go across now the way I want it to. I'm gonna do two of each. Where's the wyvern going? Is he leaving? Let's probably go get him here eventually. Do 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 do. Uh, uh, come on. Oh, 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 get it. Don't be difficult. Please don't be difficult. Oh, yeah. Come on. Please. There we go. Yay! All right. Uh, where's our wyvern? Oh boy. I should have gone back and got him sooner. Here, Mr. Wyvern. Oh, there it is. I almost lost him. That would have been terrible. La la la. Land 
this baby right here. Please, man. Pretty please. Little sugars on top. Alright. So that's the first base right there. The base section number one, I guess you could call it, however you want to call it. It's looking fantastic. Is this far enough over? No, we need to go one two more. One. Two. There we go. difficult hey do you smell oh, got a message on something hang on what's that guys Alright, here we go. Let's start building again. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. There we go. Da, 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 da. Alright, so we got that built, now we gotta start building straight up. This is gonna be fun. It's always my favorite part. I can't build anymore. But we know we can use this, so I'm just gonna go ahead and place all these babies down here. Ooh. Nice click. Do 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 Come on. You know you want to step right down? Ah. Are you just going to be difficult the whole way? Good. Just going to be difficult. Oh my goodness. Why are you being so difficult with me? No. Alright, so we're just going to go ahead and try to keep working on these here. Just trying to get the uh, first ones, because those are the tough ones to get. So you got to get them to place in a goofy way. There we go. Oh yeah, there we go. We got a little chain going here. Don't mess with the system, it's working. I hope we don't fall off the edge here. Oh, it's kind of getting close. Alright. Do 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 These are gonna get tough eventually because we have to build up just to be able to see them. Probably want to eventually put fly on, but I'm not going to because I like to show how to do it without cheats. Obviously we can IMG a little bit, but you know what I mean. Do do the scaffolding's important too. Oh boy. Alright. No, don't, don't, don't do that. No one wants you to go there. I don't know why you want to be halfway up. Come on. So 
support the friends. Please? Pity please? Should I stop? I've even cycling sad points and it's not working. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. You really want to snap in there. In the right manner. Come on. Do it for me. Do it for me. Oh, good old fashioned snapping, snapping. Being so difficult. Let's see here. Here we go. There's one. Oh, oh, I had it. <laughs> I had it. It's like you need to like cycle the snap points, but it doesn't work. I hate that so much how this cycling snap points doesn't work because it's just not showing it as a possible snap point, but I know for a fact it works. Because I've done it before a million times. Come on. Yes! We got it. We got it, yeah. Almost did they, uh, I don't remember that, that name of that thing. What's gonna work? Teamwork. I think it's Wonder Pets, I think is what it was. Oh gosh. Mistakes were made. Alright, let's just go ahead and keep working on snapping these babies in and we can place the supporting pillars in after we get all these in. Oh, there we go. See, why can't you do this every time for me? Why does it always have to be so difficult? Can't cycle into it. There we go. There we go. One more. All I'm gonna do is cycle in the. I heard him running around. I don't want it to do it that way. Can't cycle the snap point, so we just gotta dance around. Oh, 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 I saw it for a second. Nice! Alright, now we can just put everything in. Make it permanent ish. Or on this one again. And this one. Oh, we had it for a second. Oh. Come on. You know you wanna go in? You know it. Please. Pretty please. Oh. I saw it for a second. Yes. Ha. I just gotta focus. You know you can snap in there. Why? Why are snap points being so stupid? I hate pillars. I love them, but I hate them at the exact same time. Oh, we're out of pillars. Okay, so change to item number one seventy six. There we go. I only got ten. I only did ten. I'm terrible. What? Oh, because I've been in my inventory. Duh. Duh. Now I'll have to snap a pillar to a pillar. Like there we go. That's one. Let's keep working on pillars. This pillar thing's gonna take forever. I should get some music going. Is what I should do. And pull these babies back into my inventory. Try to get some music going. 
da, 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 da. I'll have to mess with that for next time because I'm sure this is very boring. I'll put it in when the get some some no copyright sounds. <laughs> has to do. Okay, I should probably edit it right now and do it right now. See, that's what we'll do. We'll just, we'll just run no copyright sounds. Let me jump over here real quick. Jump onto my web page. Just run some no copyright sounds for a little bit. I wonder if they have a giant playlist thing. Click on no copyright sounds. They have a giant playlist. Playlists. Eight videos, electronic, indie dance, tozu, hard style, dubstep, drum set, tap, house, drum and bass, melodic dubstep. We'll go with all releases. There we go. So we're going to get free ads for YouTube in here too. <laughs> oh, gaming music, live stream, live watch now. Yeah, let's do that. Turn the volume down a little bit, though. Skip that ad. There we go. Got some tunes going now. So I should just say we're watching no, no listen to no copyright sounds on YouTube. You guys can see the link in my. My page. I have no idea what's being played. <laughs> it's random. It's their gaming stream. That was a very common Roblox song. I've heard this too many times. In like every Roblox game. No, no, no. You need to go into the ground. Ha! Ah, yes. Don't disturb me. Oh no. Do 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 do. Good, looking good. We got progress. So I said we're gonna do a pseudo bottom note. I'll show you what we mean here in a little bit. I'm just gonna keep working on this for a little bit. Let's so place a bunch more ceilings. And those are 168, if I remember correctly. Oops. Oh, oh, we need some more. So, do, 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 do. 68. Yes, winning. Oh, I had ceilings in my freaking inventory. Dang it. I blame myself. I'm about to jump the time again here in a minute. It's getting dark. Oh, my favorite part of this. Just getting all the 
pieces to go where they need to go. Try to cycle it, doesn't work. Um, there we go. I'll take that, I guess. Oh, wait, that worked. Oh, maybe that's what I need to start doing. Place down the piece when I can't get the other one to go in. It looks like it might actually have worked. There we go. It spans a little bit. Oops. <laughs> this click. It was an accident, I swear. Let's give time back. Uh, so time it. Bam. You were an accident. Yeah, probably. Probably was. La, la, la. <laughs> How you doing, Kings? Oh, I gotta go up top and fix it. Hello. Can't have it uneven. It's very devoid of commentary. Uh, yeah, probably. I'm trying to. It's kind of the same thing over and over, so. <laughs> I plan on doing. just. This is what I do in the background of all my videos. So, all those tutorial videos, this is what you guys see. <laughs> this is what happens in the background. I built. <laughs> uh. Hey, at least I've got music going, man. You can enjoy that at least. I feel like I missed one somewhere. No. Nope. I did. Ah, see, I thought I missed one. Can't cycle. I hate that you can't cycle the snap points again to go the right way. How is PC? I love PC. I love the graphics. Ever since the Xbox kind of knocked out the graphics, I was kind of upset about it. I understand why they did it, to try to improve the ability to play and make bigger bases and not have them lag out the entire game. That's a great idea. Uh, but I always enjoyed the graphics of the game. I thought they were really great, and the textures are fantastic. And um, Being able to build larger bases and, and 
and do some fun stuff is really nice and getting content first is always going to be nice especially running a tutorial based channel I think is uh, kind of an important thing because I gotta be able to get those updates first get those tutorials out so you guys don't have to worry about them oh my goodness this one's going to be a problem I can already tell wait that's right use our trick that we learned last time place this baby down and place the ones around it and by that I mean misplace the ones around it. There we go. You can get the one to snap sometimes in the right spot. Haha! It did work. Alright, so that's a cool little trick to learn for pillars. If you're having problems with one snapping in the right direction, you place stuff around it. And it helps with the snap points. That's cool. Um, I hope that holds. Because <laughs> we're getting a little sketchy here on this one. Oh god. That might have Yep. <laughs> Got a wee bit stuck in there. Not using fly. There we go. I refuse. Just do the gold fashion slash suicide if I had to, but I don't have a bed down now that's stunk. <laughs> should probably put a bed down, but I think that should be fine. Alright, let's turn around. Let's do it from this direction. There we go. That's a nice song. Nice song. It's kind of funny that you would call yourself Ra Rasputin, it's actually funny. <laughs> oh, that's nice when that stuff works out like a charm. I'll take it. I'll have to remember this one. This is nice. Let's pick up this song real quick. This is right down to. So we can hang on to it. Um, carton on and on. I like that one. All right, let's get some more. 76. Bam. Let's keep building that little, little base here. Uh. Man, this one's going to be difficult, isn't it? There we go. Come on, give me the stat point. There we go. Well. I'll have to do that in a little bit. Got it down. Let's get these pillars in. Alright. Put that right there. Come on. No, why? 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 I didn't want you there. Place some more pillars. <laughs> it's gonna stink when it's down there. Oh boy, that's gonna be a just 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 fun. It's gonna be a blast. A little blasty blast. Polish killer. Oh, 
Oh, come on. Oh, what? I missed one? When did I miss one? There we go. Da, 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 da. Now we're moving. Get some more in there. It's not obstructed. I know it's not obstructed because I can see the dang pillar. And it goes green. I hate, I hate, this is the one thing I do hate. Like, why should I have to spin around just to get something to go in because it's obstructed? Well, no, it's not. You know, it's not obstructed. Ah, uh, come on. Please. Pretty please. Pretty please. Q. Q, 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 Q. Nope, no stack points. I guess we can do it that way. We'll just slap that baby in. It's obstructed. Really? You're gonna, you're gonna go this route now with me? You gonna go this route with me? Good. Come on. There we go. And no, I didn't want to do it. I feel like I'm gonna waste like so many of these just clicking. Luckily I'm not wasting. That's why again, as I said, always do this in thatch first. <laughs> Never do it straight in metal. Oh, it makes you cry a little bit when you do things straight in metal. I'm not too worried about that. Alright. Um back to over here. There we go. Mm -mm. Kings, you uh, playing on uh, gift server or are you going to jump on mine or a little bit of both? Up, oh, it's raining. Still don't get how that doesn't work. To explain how I'm underneath. A metal cover, yet it's still raining on me. Arc logic. No, what? <laughs> Come on. Let's play some pillars. Lots of pillars. Oh my goodness, no. Why are you doing that? There we go. I didn't get one to sneak under there. I don't want to mess with it. Let's not play that game. See, in what world is that obstructed? I think I can see the whole pillar. Yet it's obstructed. This pillar is obstructed. No, it's not. Stop lying to yourself. Let's just go ahead and dump this extra crud I'm gonna have. One, two, three, there we go. Do do. All right, so now we gotta figure out what we're gonna do here. So I wanna kinda make this an entrance. It's gonna be a ramp up to the behemoth gate. So the behemoth gate's actually technically gonna run right here. A couple rows back. Cause I'm gonna do a one wall high structure around here. And that's to make it so you don't see these sticking out of the base. Um, how do I want to do this then? Uh, so we should probably start doing this as far as we can. I'll just go ahead and slap those babies down. Just keep placing these things down and see what we can do. And then I'm going to have to build some kind of structure underneath. Still trying to figure out how I want to do that. So I can get in... Oh, that 
ones that support it, I see. <laughs> Those aren't touching the ground. Let's go underneath and fix that. I just miss putting them down. Winning. And by winning, I mean losing. What? What? In what world was I looking there for that to be placed there? Ugh. My goodness. I'm gonna break you. I literally broke you, haha. <laughs> Pun intended. Alright, so there's the two spots, which means the four beams next to it, which I'm actually really not shocked at which ones these look like they are. Yeah, not surprised on this one. But these are the ones that aren't supported. Um, okay, well, that kind of worked. Oh, there we go. Got one to go. And two. Maybe that did it. Maybe that gave me the support I needed. What? Ugh. Nobody likes you anyhow. Alright, so let's go ahead and start placing some of these down. These are going to be fun. It's only going to get funner from here. We started on the easy part, and then the hard part's going to be in. So we'll have to start the tutorial again. And I wouldn't even call it a tutorial, just the highlight reel. And we do that again. Come on. Why are you being so challenging with me? Mm. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. Yes. I'm sure some of it's because we're building where we're building and everything, so let's get some more. Some more pillars. You know you want a place. Snap. There we go. Excellent. They need to make these rocks, s make it so they're stable bases. Cause half the time, like when you place stuff in there, like they don't even count as in. Okay, why are you being difficult, Mister? Oh, you know you're gonna go in there. You know you're gonna work. Yeah. Do, do, do. 
together. Oh. oh, nice. The extra one in there. Hopefully we don't, because this is where I'm worried about it. It's coming up. Oh, wow. Okay. Good thing I have God mode on. <laughs> that would have hurt otherwise. No, you're not obstructed. I know you're not. Yeah, see? See? Not obstructed. Neither are you. Um. Okay. Just keep working. Got it. All right, back up top. I'm out of running. I was actually excited to do this build. This was one of my more exciting builds I was going to do. It's, uh, I feel like it's a different build. All right, so let's think about this for a second. So if I can get that to snap down the way that's supposed to be. Should I run this one? Yeah, I should run that one too. I can only span six technically, and that's if I can get the foundation in there. Because I'm going to have to skip these, but not this one. This one doesn't have to get skipped. There we go. Ugh. Build, please. Yes. Alright, so that one's gonna stay. That one will stay too. that one too it looks like if I can get it to place if I can get these things to snap in the right spot oh nice I have to do some rock climbing here a little bit the hardest part is not doing this without stepping off the edge Doing this. Uh, looks like it's time to. We're about to get that the shade of uh, the volcano. I'm just done on this side, but I think a lot of these I'm not going to be able to get. making some scaffolding. Everybody loves to make scaffolding. That's right, this one can go all the way across. This is the first level can. Come on. Stop being difficult. 
Let's go there. Yep. There you go. You go there. You go there. It's like a jazz almost on this one. On this song. It's like a jazz. I need some building for tips, my friend. What kind of tips do you mean, Ness? Let's hear them. I know it's easier to bring them from the ground up, but I'm because of where I'm building, I can't do it that way. I tried it once, uh, and the issue is, is you get the no foundation supports, and that's including putting foundations at the bottom, if that's what you're going to bring up. <laughs> and you can't cycle these snap points like you want to because it's being difficult. Because when I cycle snap points... Do, 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 do. No, I don't need pillars every single thing. You're definitely right on that. It can go six wide. I'm just doing it up here because I'm not sure how I'm going to uh, carve the rest of it afterwards. So I'm just doing every single one on this one because that's why I like right here. I'm not going to do it because I'm going to leave a gap right here. So you can get the volcano cave. But yeah, no, I know. I know I don't need a pillar every single one. And that's why I said I was going to do six wide over here. I'm just doing the base right now. I'm not going to do it on the uh, whole thing. Because once I get out there, it's going to be ridiculously long. And side note, Ness, if you didn't know, I've... Uh, this is my tutorial base for my tutorial world. Uh, I'm spotting all the pillars in, so <laughs> just as a heads up. <laughs> Might explain why I'm not as ca caring about snapping every single one. It just gives it a cool look, I feel like, too, having all the pillars. My goodness. This is a looks build. It's not necessarily a 100% uh, functional. Granted, you could probably do it with PvP, but I wouldn't suggest it. I'd suggest stacking foundations and doing ramps. It's always the best way to go. It's always hard when you do pillars. When I put fly on to put the pillars in, I don't know. I always like the the challenge of trying to mountain climb and um, and do it that way. I guess I could fly. I, I don't know. I don't have a valid reason. <laughs> As you're about to see, <laughs> pillars on. Probably, I probably should. It probably take me ten times less time. You have a valid point on that one. All right, you win, sir. Oh, I cheat Ness.
Come on. Eh, you're not getting any support, whatever. Yeah, let's get this one to work. Please. Can't be the only one. Nice cheat. Yeah, I know. All right, so Ness, here's a good question for you. If you had a cheat that was your name, what would you make it be? And it can't be like one that already exists. So it's got to be kind of a, oh, I guess technically every cheat exists. So something fun. You can't be like got them. Cause that's just boring. <laughs> uh, did music stop? Oh, no, there it goes. Once again, uh, I'd like to keep calling it out. I'm doing uh, the 24-hour stream from no copyright music, so if you guys are wondering what I'm listening to, I don't exactly know. I'd have to go look at the YouTube thing if you want to specifically hear Oh, oh there it is. There's a snap point. Oh, come on. Stop being so difficult. There we go. Right, I'm going to change the time, too, so you guys can see again. Might as well do that right now. Set time of day. Bam. We can see again. Yay. <laughs> now, are you talking about like going Conan Exiles, drop all of them, or are you talking about Arc, drop all clothes? And I'm guessing this would only work on, uh, not, on, on obviously not like uh, PvP servers, because that would be kind of unfair if you really thought about it. But then again, cheats are just not unfair in general, because let's be honest, they're cheats. <laughs> okay, why are you being difficult, Mr. Snappoint? Let's just try to cycle it here. Nope. Let's go down. You're going to be challenging, aren't you? You're going to be one of those. Oh, you're going to... Oh, it's going to be one of those. See, this is why I, I hate pillars. Is sometimes it's because of this mess. Because <laughs> now it's claiming I have no foundation support. Even though I know I do for a fact. I could even place like a foundation down here. And it wouldn't make a difference. <gasps> oh, pillars. I loathe thee. It's going to be difficult to see that this whole way. Uh, what am I building? I'm building my tutorial base. I kind of just build stuff. So um, I try to build it over the volcano cave. Um, what's the tutorial for? I just like to have a tutorial base. Um, this is my tutorial server. I do a lot of tutorials. If you check out my channel, uh, I used to do them on uh, Xbox and I had a whole like tutorial building. So I'm just kind of doing one on this server just to kind of Make it so I've got one on PC now, so I can start doing all my nice tutorials. Uh, and I figured right here would be a good spot because we got the Ascension Cave coming. Um, so it's just a tutorial building. It's not necessarily like a specific tutorial. I'm just doing a lot of building tips and tricks while I'm doing this. Um, one of which is how much pillars stink because they do stupid crap like this. Oh, yeah, we got it. Yay. Um, I hate pillars when they do that kind of weird stuff where they don't give you foundation support even though there's foundation support, um, which is the reason that I do it from the ceilings down and not leveling it because I'm going to raise up this so the, uh, there's going to be a, like a level between the actual floor and this floor just so it looks pretty. Thank you. It's going to take a while. Um, I'm spawning everything and I'm not trying to lie to anyone and be like, oh, you, you, you earned all these resources? No, no, I didn't. It's a tutorial world. I'm not going to sit there and farm up all the resources. <laughs> I've done that too many times on other worlds. And it's tutorials. You don't have to do as much stuff like that. So I've done many of my tutorials on PvP servers. That was always fun. When someone comes over and kill, destroys your team right in the middle of a tutorial. I love S+. S+, plus is fantastic. Um, but most of my uh, following um, is on officials or on the councils, and they can't get S+. Plus. I plan on doing some mod uh, places. Uh, I think the next mod we're going to use is actually going to be S plus comboed, possibly with the moon mod. Uh, it's going to be fun. Uh, I've got a bunch of guys that I play with, and we're going to probably 
build up on a moon mod and, and have some fun on there and build some cool bases and kind of do some tutorials on there because I know that mod's kind of confusing to some people. So I thought it'd be kind of fun. Uh, but no, I'm not using S Plus right now. Um, it's like one of the greatest mods because you can do the click and the demo gun and everything, and it's fantastic. But sometimes it's good to do some vanilla mods or vanilla tutorials. You reach a broader base. Do, 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 do. All right. There we go. Oh, could just build scaffolding to get up here, but I hate building scaffolding. I think it's annoying because then you got to tear it all down by building scaffolding. <laughs> I've got a scaffold to scaffold to build it down. Ugh, you're gonna be difficult, really. And I'm sorry for the sniffling on the, the the voice. I am a little sick, so I'm trying. I'm, I'm about to beat it. Been sick for a couple days. Come on, there we go. Oh my goodness, because I want to take this thing all the way out to about um, here-ish. I'm thinking in this ballpark, because I want to do like a ramp down the middle. So kind of give you guys an idea. You can check out my pictures if you want. This is for the Spanish community. I'll have to come check them out. Um, my Spanish is not the greatest. Uh, I haven't uh, mastered the language. I've taken a lot of it. I understand it decently, but it's not my favorite. But uh, what I want to do is take a ramp and actually bring like a ramp down from the structure uh, over the top of the cave. So then I can put like dino gates on the side of each of the ramp. So you can get into the cave from the dino gates and then have like my like storage and manufacturing on like one side and kind of make like a U do some angled mods and stuff on there. Not mods, but uh, do the good old-fashioned um, fence foundation angles um, to give a kind of a cool angled effect. Um, and that's why I don't use S-Plus as much is because it does give you all those pieces, and I sometimes like to kind of keep things classic, um, you know, so you can do it. I don't, I'm don't. not saying S-Plus is bad. I love it. It's a fantastic mod. I just, you know, once I start getting more PC people that, that watch me, I guess I would say, change it over and check in my pictures if you want i will ness um i'll definitely have to to do that for you there oh there we go i really wish with pillars sniping snap points actually works but the reason we get a lot of the glitches we get and the things we can do like stacking foundations and things like that is because of how messed up pillars are. So at the same time, I hate them. I love them because they give us so many cool things we can do. Um, you know, one of the things I hate the most is that right there. Like why? But that's the only reason we can stack pillars and foundations and stuff. Do do. Uh, so, and I'm thinking about doing like some like little like, uh, like greenhouses off the side using dino gates and greenhouse glass so it comes in off the side and looks like kind of a, like a bay window greenhouse if that makes sense. Um, just kind of adds my, just, as I said, I'm kind of making this kind of a fun little base. It's not necessarily going to be overly functional, um, but it's just kind of a vanilla build, I guess you could say. Just a place I can do tutorials inside if I need to make you know paints or something. If I'm showing people how to cut hairs or the new haircuts and stuff, it's just nice to have a place to to turn back to and not have to spawn everything single thing in every time or you know be worried that I'm not too far into a, in a server I can't do this tutorial itself. So as I said, this is my tutorial room. I can't put a link in this chat. You can't. Let me, let me double check. Hang on. Um advanced settings no that's not what I wanted oh I, I booped no I don't I don't care about that oh it's gonna freeze out on me now too fantastic so I've got a second PC over there or a second computer over there so when it goes stupid I can keep working there we go uh, put that together. Steam community. I could just check your profile if it's the same as that one. So I'll check it out though. 
You said there's a, a picture of the, the server in your profile. It's an RP server, you said. PvE RP or PvP? I don't know if I remember seeing that. Uh, come on. Drop it, pillars. It's like, should I just name this like pillars for days? It's probably what I should have named this, not building my tutorial base. <laughs> What are you doing? Placing pillars? <laughs> this will actually end up being a shorter clip once I get it up. Oh my goodness. The misplaces are real. It's three servers actually. That's pretty cool. I'll have to look into it. I have to look into it. Now we're trying to get our own servers up for the, the channel. I've already got the Xbox one back up. Um, I don't personally play it on there, obviously. You guys can tell. Um, and then we're going to probably pick up a server to a, our server cluster for playing on. For this one, we'll do like a PvE, PvP, and I don't know, a couple other things or something. We'll figure it out. Oh yay, we're on with ceilings again. Another row of ceilings, just what we needed, right? More pillars to place. This is only going to get worse. <laughs> yep, 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 there it is. The red, the red of shame, I shall call it. It is six, isn't it? Because I'm trying to remember, one, two, three. I thought you could place three out from a direct pillar. It was in a straight line. Oh, it's from the pillar, so it's only four. God, I'm losing my mind today, right? One, two, three, yep, yep, it's four. So then I could do two, two, and then it's six, so you can technically do four between. So I'll have to fix that. You were like the master builder, and they made me king of one of the kingdoms. So does that mean I have to like, start calling you your highness or something? Is that what <laughs> going with? I'm messing with you. <laughs> uh, why are you being difficult? Alright, let's see if we can get this to go down. You have support. Everyone saw me put the sports down. Nobody likes you. Nobody likes you when you're fussy. I'm probably going to have to ghost in here to get those supports actually to stick, but... Let's just go ahead and see if we can get this to work. Which would stink. But it's probably going to have to happen, I have a feeling. Let's find out. Yep. We're going to have to ghost. Like, why is this rock not considered? I never understood why they do that. Like, these rocks are here. You can't access them. You can't go through them. But they don't count as support. No. GG arc. GG. <laughs> Night guest at least. <laughs> now I've thought about getting into RP servers. I think they could be fun. Back when I used to play that Dungeons and Dragons, I always had a blast on those. If you had the right group of people though. If you had the wrong group of people, it can get kind of annoying. Yes, got it to work. Aha. Cheating the system, 101. Let's see if we can get these things to work. Come on, you know you want to place. No! Why is it dislike me so much? The funny part is I might be able to do this. What do you think the odds are? Nope, I can't get the stack in there. That one I might be able to get though. Nope, looks like we're going to be ghosting. That's not fun. Because if I can't get those to place, it's going to be a huge issue. Oh boy. 
What's this song remind me of? It reminds me of the song. I don't know. No. Nice. Got that one to work. Place two out here. Can't get one there yet. So that's going to be, we're going to do three in the middle. So those three, so that one's going to be ran down. Let's go ahead and try to run this one down and see if we can get a support off of it to keep building. And we'll do the other ones for beautification reasons. Oh, oh I know it's going to take me forever. <laughs> oh, I know. <laughs> this isn't going to be a small build. <laughs> But you go ahead and get some sleep, man. No worries. I just thought I'd share it because people have asked what it's like when you're building crazy bases like this. And I said, it takes forever. Oh, the scary part is going to be that part. Ugh. It's going to be terrible. What are you doing up there, monkey? Why are you in my place? See if we can get this one to place, and I can maybe get these things to place across, hopefully. This one should go in. No. Why? I want you in there. I want you on that one. Not this one. This one. One, on. one two, three. Those are the middle three that I'm leaving alone. This one's just going to be difficult the whole way. Oh, I could spawn a bunch more. If you see my weight, I've already got 100, so like I could spawn a whole bunch in. And it's not going to be an issue. I'm not too worried about it. I'm just spawning them in because it's a quick two seconds of a button. <laughs> There we go. You'll have to check it out when I'm done, though, Ness. This thing's going to take, I'm guessing, a couple days, probably. So I'm going to get the base down. and Once I get the base down, it actually should be faster. It's the pillars that are going to take forever. Come on, that was a support. Oh, I hate you so much right now, game. Sometimes you can get lucky. I'm gonna have to ghost. Dang it! Actually, you know what? No. One, two. Yeah, I'm going to have to go. So I think. Oh, no. Unless I can get this one to work. Another game of trying to get the pillar to place where I wanted to place. Yes, it would be. No, I know exactly what you're saying. The 12 height pillars. Oh. I, dude, I came in. I, it's gonna probably take me about what forty pillars, just not not that many. Thirty pillars, just on that back end over there. Oh, it's gonna be terrible. It's gonna be terrible. Oh, come on. Why why are you being difficult? Nobody likes things when they're difficult. Oh oh oh! oh I had a point. Yes. Yeah, so this one's gonna snap, and then that one's gonna snap in right with it. You're gonna snap. And then I hit Q. And I hate the snap points. Like, they just... Mm, 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 mm. Vanilla arc snap points. 
frustration is real. Wait, why did I do those other ones? I wasn't supposed to do those, was I? No, yeah, I was. Sorry. This one's got to become a foundation. It's got to be a foundational support. I was I have indeed do do. Please, please, please. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Yes. You don't use that. What do you mean, Christian? I'm confused. I don't need to use that anyway. seeing pillars in my sleep tonight. <laughs> I'm like, the pillars. Oh come on. You're gonna you're gonna do that. You're gonna do that really. Let's see how it is. No, no, no one No one likes it like you do that. No one likes it when you do that. the discord the discord is going off <laughs> come on stop being difficult pillars just go be able to. Oh, yeah. Gotta love when a plan comes together. <laughs> I really should name it. I should just name it. <laughs> pillars, pillars, pillars. What about non-copyright music? Um, it's uh, the, the station that I listen to in the background. If you can hear the music coming through. You should be able to. I don't know why you wouldn't be. That is not game audio, so... Or, sorry, desktop audio. It's um, a channel on YouTube. Um, they have music that you can use, download everything it's really it's actually kind of a cool one I use a lot in like my PvP videos and stuff like that just get something to listen to other than you know on like moments like this like right now <laughs> yeah can you not hear it Ness because I've got it running in the background right now if you can't hear it let me know I can do an audio plug-in into OBS I had set it up for anything in the background to make noise. Do, 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 do. Uh. Do, do. 
You can't hear it? Oh, alright, hold on. Let me do an audio plugin. Do, do, just add that baby in there. Oh, yeah, I see what you're talking about now. Add audio input output capture. Okay. Alright. Is that better? <clears throat> Turns out a little bit though. It's a little loud. <laughs> Here we go. How's the volume now? Obviously, it was a little loud when I first turned it on. <laughs> yeah. Check in again, let me see. What was I've got it negative thirty decibels right now, so thirty five, we'll turn it down a little bit more. Fifty one decibels, that should be good, right about there. Alright, we'll test it right there. You tell me where you're at. <clears throat> nice. Alright, good. Yeah, I've had it playing for me the whole time. <laughs> I guess you guys just didn't get it. So, OBS can be fussy sometimes. I hate when it does that. Yeah, we're just not going to do that. No, you need to. Come on. I think I might take a break from pillars after this because I need a break. <laughs> Start working on the front gate. Once I get this one to snap, just in general. Looks like it doesn't even want to snap in here. Nobody wants you. Nobody likes it when you're difficult. I can't hear it now? Okay, my bad. Uh, so we were at... Let's go back to 27. 28, there we go. Oh, there we go. Speaking of no copyright sounds, one of the things that really drove me nuts was recently um, there was a guy, um, Nova, if you've ever heard the song by Eric's, he went and switched to copyright and then just started copywriting a bunch of people's stuff. It was actually kind of really annoying. I was like, really dude, like you can't just go from no copyright to copyright and saying, oh, I'm going to take everyone's monetization from YouTube. Not a functional, so we can just move on. Oh, it's getting dark. Time of day. Ooh, we're getting there. It's looking fantastic. 
I think this could be a really cool build, actually, for a vanilla, vanilla build. I almost said vanilla wow. Well, wow. I haven't played vanilla wow in so long. <laughs> so many pillars. I should just change the name. I'm gonna add it to the uh, I'm gonna just call it pillars, pillars, pillars. <laughs> There we go. Ugh. Alright, so uh, we're going to start working over here. We're going to start working on a little structure, so we need to get some walls. Get some walls. 79. I count out how many we're gonna do first. So if we can do it here, let's make sure we place these the right way though. So we want the front side because I'm gonna run the ramps off the back. So I actually technically need them here. Yes. I had to think about where I was gonna place those and I was gonna do the ramp. Probably do a little, a little quick record over. Welcome back, those who are on the tutorial watching us build this base. Uh, we are doing this on live stream, so you're going to still hear some music in the background. It's going to be fun. Uh, guys, we're going to go ahead and start working on some of these walls. I've gotten a little burnt out from the pillars. As you guys can see, we've got a whole pile of pillars going on here. Um, we're going to start building the walls in preparation for the ramp to go up that we're going to build. Um, I just want to get these walls in and I got to figure out how money I'm going to do. Um, I'm going to do a metal behemoth so that's going to be nine because uh, you want to have the extra so you need the seven ramps or the seven fence foundations in the middle. I like to have two extra around the side so I'm going to do a nine long wall. And our foundations are ten so we'll stop there for that one because that one's four and that one's five if I remember correctly. And then we can just place our walls here. Let's make sure we cycle the point correctly. There we go. So um, that's where we're at right now, guys. We're working on that stuff here. And we can run around the base and take a look at what we're looking at uh, for the <laughs> massive build, I guess would be the way to put it. Um, we have tons of pillars already into this thing. It was kind of getting a little bit to us, so we uh, moved on to other stuff. The hardest part's gonna be getting the supports to work in. I think we've got the major issues done because now we're on solid ground again for the middle section, so we should have supports the whole way through. So it's looking pretty quick and it's looking pretty good. Uh, we still have probably about two times the amount of work to go to get all the way out there and have our ramp going down. I just gotta decide when I'm gonna start doing our ramp down. I think I'm gonna do about six or seven further out. So. Um, we'll go ahead and keep working on these walls, guys, and uh, we'll uh, see you guys uh, that are watching the highlight rail. We'll see you guys back here in a little bit when we've got these walls in a little bit of a better shape. So we'll see you guys here in a little bit. Stop recording. <clears throat> All right, back to the building. So I'm gonna build a ramp there. I'm gonna build that there. I'm gonna put that there. Alright, we can 
putting some of these ceilings down though now, which will be nice. So we gotta make sure these are the same direction as the other ones though. Which I can't really remember which way they were. They were going that way. So place them, snap that baby around. Voila! So this is actually gonna be our floor for our real base. As I said, I kinda did like a, a pseudo floor <laughs> on this other one. Um, I thought it'd be kind of cool. All right, Ness, we'll see you around, man. Uh, thanks for stopping in and uh, chit-chatting. It was it was fun, sir. I'm sure you'll see a updated video on the channel later. Ah, uh, these walls are some floors. Sixty-eight. Oh no! Can't have it backwards. That was a missed place. Misplaced. I'm doing well on these edge ones. I think the whole row's technically done. We're really gonna see if it's gonna be an issue here soon. I just thought about the fact that. Mistakes were made. Ooh, it's looking good. Right, let's get our ramps spawned. I'm trying to decide if I want to do ramps or I should just do sloped roofs. I'm leaning towards sloped roofs, actually. Slope roofs on here now. Sloped metal roofs, which are your number? Let's tech. 
tech. I don't. No one cares about tech right now. We're building this baby out of metal. Oh, here we go. Slope metal roof. 403. I don't really need a lot of them, though, do I? Not 1403. Uh, we'll spawn 10 of these babies in. Maybe we can get them to work the right way. One hopes, right? I'm going to pause the music for a minute while we continue our little recording for those. We'll stop for a minute. Start recording. There we go. And welcome back again, guys. So you guys can see, we've started building the base of our floor here. We're going to go ahead and place some slope metal roofs. This is actually what we're going to go with. Um, and we're hoping that I don't have to place down some corners to get them to place correctly. But we'll see in a minute. So we're going to go ahead and try to get these things to snap in the proper way. Oh, look at that. It's going to be so nice. Thank you. So we're just going to go ahead and place these babies down. It's going to look nice and pretty here. This is going to be the entrance to our behemoth gate. So uh, this is going to be the access to getting to like our dino pen and stuff like that. And then we're going to have, obviously, part of it on the other side. So it's going to be kind of fun. I think in the front, I've decided I'm only going to do a double dino gate. It might be kind of fun. Oh, don't do this now. There we go. So we're going to go ahead and keep placing these. Um, I think it's going to turn out really, really well and everything. So we're going to go ahead and get some foundations in. Um, we're going to start building the, oh boy, the latency. So we're just going to go ahead and spin this thing. There we go. That stuff spun up. And there we go. Look at that. It looks really nice. It looks really clean. Uh, you can tell it's out foundations, but uh, we're going to go ahead and just say, look, it looks really nice. I'm going to do ramps off the front of this, most likely. That's what I think I'm going to end up doing is the ramps off the front. And then it's just going to be a nice little clean ramp right up. And then you're going to have a behemoth gate right here. And then you're going to enter the base here. So... We're going to go ahead and continue. Uh, let's go ahead and get those fence foundations done really quick. So uh, we'll go ahead and Pause the video for a second, and I'll jump in and get those fence foundations here really fast for everyone. We just gotta find them. Metal fence foundations number. We gotta do the metal behemoth gate too, cause we gotta have it as a metal behemoth gate. But we can't really put the behemoth gate in yet, so I'm not worried about it, cause we gotta put the foundations in, and then we've gotta put the walls up and everything. So, uh, so 171 is gonna be the number we're looking for. So we'll do 171. 171. Bata. Put those babies in our inventory. There we go. So let's go ahead and get these guys snapped in here. Um, we'll hit Q to place them in. And we're just going to go ahead and place them. Uh, oops. I don't need these. I only need eight or seven. So we got to skip that first one. And then we're going to go ahead and place the second one. We'll spin that baby. I'm going to put them right here. I want it kind of in there more. Uh, I don't want it out on the front. I kind of like the way it looks right there. So we still got to keep this looking really good here. Let's go snap there we go oh that was a misplace that's why you get a couple extra of them <laughs> ouch gotta love that misplace there we go and let's get another one snapped in here there we go there we go there we go there we go and that's it so that's actually all of them uh so then we'll be placing i our walls here, just like this. So I'll place them on the side. And this will be technically the edge of our base now. Um, as you guys can see, we've got the pseudo floor, I guess you'd call it, uh, because I was having issues with the pillars because they give this weird issue where sometimes they don't claim that they're on support even though they're on support. So it's, it's, it's very goofy. Um, but so basically what we got here is we've got something like this. Uh, I'm not going to go ahead and finish this because I might be tearing some of this out to make it like an angle right here possibly is what I'm thinking about doing or doing some kind of fun stuff right here. I haven't fully decided yet. I'm going to have to get some fence foundations out when I do that. But it looks kind of cool. Um, we're getting there. You guys can see the pseudo foundations are back here again. You guys can see the pseudo floor underneath. So it kind of has it there. We'll have to put like a hatch frame to get down uh, just to kind of show it. But this is like the beautification side. This is the beautiful side. And this is what it looks like when you're not doing the beautiful stuff. It's kind of crazy if you think about it. So uh, we'll see you guys here back in a little bit. Uh, as I said, this is the continuation of this build. We're doing the highlight reel, and we can just get back to the stream and everything here in a minute, guys. So hang on one second. Back to the music, too. Yay! Yeah. 
You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna get these done. So I can know how far I'm going. Thank you. That to step in. Oh, yep, yep. Aha! We got it! Oh, gotta spawn some more. Yeah, 176. There we go. Because we haven't used enough pillars, I guess. Ba -ba -da 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 -da. We're going to keep working at this for probably another 30 minutes or so, guys, and then we're going to jump off. I'm hoping to get the ramp done is really what my goal is right now. Uh, I just kind of got to decide how far I want to take this out. So what this is going to come down to. So maybe that's what we'll do. We'll focus on, we'll get the ramp done. It'll be fantastic. At least we hope it'll be fantastic. I like the way it's looking though. I think I think it's one of my, my one of my favorite builds I've done, uh, especially for vanilla. Obviously, you can do some really cool stuff with S plus and everything, but it's a vanilla mod I think, or non modded vanilla. I think it's kind of ended up being a really cool little build. So all this stuff should go right back in. Yep, there we go. Look at that. It's kind of cool to see how like this thing <laughs> I'm hiding, I guess you could say. Not hiding. We got the cave underneath there and it just walks right into it. And I think it'll be really cool. Um, trying to decide how far I want to go out before I drop the ramp. Because in order to do the ramp, I'm going to have to do foundations. Because I want to place... Um, what's the word I want to use? Um... Uh-huh. I want to place dino gates in there underneath the ramp. So it's not going to be, it's going to be walls on the ramp versus pillars. So I have to do foundations at the base of the pillars and run it up. So I'm just going to have to run the foundations out, see how far it goes, and hope to goodness I can get this kind of flat. I doubt that's going to work, though. Right, back to the build, sorry. I get a drink. I was parched.
Come on, snap in there. What are you doing? Why are you being so difficult? Mr. Biller. Give me a treat. Sometimes you just need to place a new one. I think I got a message. I should probably check the Discord real quick. Oh, who do we have? Netflix guy. This is really going to depend on where I want to place the dino gates to get underneath. Well, this one's going to go here. I think I'm going to need to do at least four more. If I had to guess. Look, it's Deadly's body. Hi, Deadly. He said some torpidity to him. <laughs> Don't. 
Things looking awesome. Yep, yep, that's perfect. Two's gonna do it perfectly. Let's gotta start our ramp. I almost want to make it five wide. It is five wide. Oh, that's gonna be great. Uh, yes. I love when a plan works out like this. Do 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 PC member. All right, now we have to think about how we want to do the ramp.
it's sloped roofs. I could do the angles on it. Top down. Oh boy. Oh, we're trying to figure out right now how to run the slope roofs down. Four, 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 five. This way, right? Just a thought. Doesn't matter on that one. Do a ramp, yeah, do a combo unit, that'll work. Alright, welcome back everyone. We are here working on our tutorial build still. As you guys can see, I know you guys just got back. We have been working very hard. We're working on the ramp now. I've been trying to figure out how I want to approach 
the ramp, I guess, would be the best way to put it. Um, I've, I've kind of messed around down here, and I was kind of figuring out, like, well, I could do it this way, I could do it this way, I could do it this way. And basically what I've decided is I'm willing to do it like this. So how we did this is I'm going to show you uh, kind of on this side. Basically, I found a spot that I wanted to place the ceiling, slap the ceiling in, and I ran it out and ran some foundations, some pillars underneath it. Uh, remember, we're just getting dino gate access. We're not specifically grabbing anything more than just dino gates themselves. So, basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to place this in here. I don't need this anymore. Um, and basically what you're gonna, we're going to do is we're going to have it where it runs across. The dino gate's going to enter from this side on this one. Um, we'll just ramp it or something and make it look pretty over the top of this. Uh, probably run it like this actually um, and hopefully it kind of runs right over the top of this I'll grab some more ceilings really quick guys I apologize uh, and then basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna place these little pillars underneath uh, hopefully they don't do that that's what we were trying to avoid doing um, so let's we'll go ahead and snap these babies in uh, they should under here hopefully fingers crossed snap in just like that and I should be able to place them even with the other ones and it still gives me technically support just like not like that and so what we're gonna do is we're gonna run our door right here um, I'll figure out exactly what I'm doing here um, obviously you guys can see I'm having a little bit of an issue I'll tear down these and level them off and stuff so um, hopefully we don't get the pillar air here uh, so this is another little tip you guys can kind of use as you guys can see we're having some issues here getting these things to snap in properly so that's why I have to do it this way so what I'll do is I'll actually place it like this place the thing down rip this up all right let's go the ceiling up ah uh, it didn't stay Dang it. all right so we'll just go ahead and figure this out um, technically we can just run this out like this and if I can get this to snap properly we could just do it that way or I could just start running the ramps now and we're not to worry about it that's what we'll do. So we'll just run the ramps right off the edge of this. Um, we'll place one more snap point down here, I guess, is technically what we're going to do. I really don't like that being there, uh, but unfortunately I have a feeling we're going to be kind of SOL on this one. Uh, unfortunately, it's not going to look very beautiful, and I really want to figure out why that's not doing that. Um, what can I do to get around this? So you guys going to see some problem solving here. Uh, <laughs> very few times do you guys get to see the, the thoughts behind the actions, and I think what I'm going to do is this. Then I get the snap point. Come on. Let's just scoom up a little bit. There we go. So you guys got to see right there. Uh, basically what you do is uh, I was able to create a snap point technically right across here. So now I can run my ramps. Hopefully if this gives me, oh my goodness, it's going to give me another snap point. Yes. So we can do that. We can tear this baby up because we don't need it anymore. Don't need this one anymore. So there we go. This is kind of our little ramp that we're going to produce. Uh, I'm going to run the ramps right off the edge of this, run some ramps right off the edge of this, uh, and we'll get that as our entrance. So what we did, I uh, apologize for kind of taking off for a minute there. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep placing my walls up. But basically what we're going to do is we are going to place a, we're going to place a dino gate in there. Um, it's an inevitability. Um, I'll have to snap in. Oh, I forgot to snap in my fence foundations which I have as 403 sloped 171 is my fence foundations so you guys get to see kind of what's happening here on this little episode uh, I'm not trying to hide it from you uh, hopefully this lets me do it if not we're gonna have to tear these whole things down and cry a little bit as the entire thing comes tumbling down and I think we're gonna have to go with option B yep so everyone everyone just kind of laugh so we're gonna, you guys get to see these builds all the way from scratch Yay! so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be placing uh, behemoth gates in right here. Um, and by that I mean misplacing my fence foundation because I can't see what I'm doing. Because of the debris. So we'll go ahead and place these ones over here first. So we're going to close this in, kind of make it like an enclosed little place that we can spend, not spend, but put our items. Uh, we're going to put that there. We'll place this one here. We'll come over here and place this one down right like that and then that one down just like that so there we go that's the place uh, I'm also not going to actually technically as bad as this about to sound uh, I am not going to remove I'm gonna place all my walls down and then I'm going to be putting down I'm gonna put the, the actual gate inside and just kind of slap it actually you know what I know what I can do we'll do this the right way 
So basically what we're going to have to end up doing is producing a thing. So we know we're going to be too much higher, too higher. So that's why I was doing these. Um, we're going to show you guys kind of how to build, I guess technically build a ramp uh, would be the best way to put it. So we're going to build this straight up. Uh, this fence foundation or this wall is not going to stay. Um, we don't want that. We wanted E. So this wall is not going to stay because I'm going to bring those walls very specifically straight down from the top. So basically what I'm going to be doing is building a straight wall down here. I'll just kind of give you guys an idea. Um, because it's going to be uneven because I want to kind of pile a bunch of walls in here and cover this whole thing for our little base. So it looks very, very cool because um, I want to kind of make this kind of a covered area for it. So we're going to come down and if you see, it's not going to be even. That's why I decided to do it that way instead of the other way. It's going to look a little goofy down here, but it's going to level out much better when we get up here and actually start building the stuff. So let's get some more walls real quick. Uh, those are one... Oh boy. Uh, I gotta remember what walls are, 168, 179? Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! The brain is working! Yeah, successful! Alright, so we're really gonna kinda figure out here what's gonna happen. So, um, what I'm gonna do is technically even this off first. So we know that's gonna be technically one below, so that would be one. So two would be here for that one. And so this is the third one, so we're gonna rip that all up and place that. So what we're doing here is I'm technically creating a ramp out of sloped roofs. The reason I'm doing that is because it's going to be necessary. However, it's going to be off center on here. So what I'm going to do is actually place, uh, as funny as this is about to sound, I'm actually going to end up placing a ramp right here uh, to kind of even it out. And it's going to look a little crazy when you guys see it. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and start working on that. You guys can kind of see. Um, I'll start placing it and what I'm going to do is to keep this thing structurally sound what we're going to have to do is place sloped roofs all the way up all the way over it's going to be interesting at best so we'll go ahead and continue to place these things um, let's go ahead and get these sloped roofs to start coming in so let's grab a couple sloped roofs for you guys so you guys can kind of see the craziness as it happens I only have 10 of them right now uh, but it's going to help describe what we're going to do a little bit better here for I finish this is because this is going to kind of I'm going to sum up the episode here, uh, unfortunately, because I need to um, continue to build a lot of stuff here. So basically what I'm going to do is this is going to be the slope for the ramp, and then I have to place um, walls down here. So we're technically not going to place anything here, um, but what I need to do is place this here like this, and then we're going to have to run the walls all the way up. And then I'm going to replace them. So what I'll do is I'll pause the video here real quick for you guys. And I'll finish this one side and throw a dino gate in it so you can see what's going to happen. But basically you have to run these walls all the way up. And then you have to place this, the roofs, the sloped roofs, because they're technically structurally sound, um, on top of this. And then what I need to do is place it on the other side. And then I need to run a pseudo ceiling across the top. Um, so let's just go ahead and I'm going to show you guys what I mean by that it's for the pseudo ceiling. So if I don't place a ceiling right now at this point right here, so we're talking literally straight this ceiling right here, uh, we're going to be placing ceilings just like this. I have to. Um, the reason we have to do this is because when I go to place my little uh, dino gates, uh, it will collapse otherwise because I don't have the support underneath for it. So what I have to do is create supports on my own for the ceilings or the walls that are going to be above the dino gate. So, once I get this thing done, I can pull out all the pieces I need to pull out. And you guys can see how these are going to be all centered, but they're going to close off real nicely. So then I can take this piece, this little five piece, and place it here. Oh, nope, 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 nope. <laughs> Just joking. I'm going to place it here. And then we can place this one here, and this one here. And then I can take my sloped roofs and continue them up to here. And then, then we're gonna hit this gap that I was talking about. And what I'm gonna do is, as I said, is I'm just gonna run a ramp right down. And that's all it's gonna be. So there's gonna be little ramps that run right here. Um, however, you guys have to remember that we're running the ramps from a different location because technically this is not the base of the foundation. Technically I have to run it higher. So what I'm gonna do is tear up back to these things because I forgot about the fact that I'm off by one. <laughs> Dang it! Uh, so we're gonna tear all this stuff up, guys. Um, and basically this whole thing should fall, which it did not. So we're going to go ahead and I have to go one higher on this before I actually place it because I forgot about the fact that we are going to go one higher on here because we are doing a pseudo floor. 
So I'm going to go ahead, as I said, tear this up real quick. I apologize for that. But we'll go ahead, uh, catch you guys up here in a minute for those of you watching on the video. And we'll go ahead and get these ramps put in and all that kind of fun stuff. And it's going to be kind of interesting here. Uh, so it's going to be a lot of work. Um, and we got to have it. So then, as I said, it's going to go like this. And then obviously this wall is going to be one higher than that one. Um, but the thing is, is it doesn't matter because this is the wall that matters, is the wall we're looking at right now. So I can go ahead and place all these walls right here that we know we're going to place. And by that I mean that, uh, 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 because we know that's going to be our, our technically our, our walls for the base. So this is the base coming over here. It's going to run all the way over here. Um, we don't even know if it's going to run this way, but... I know I'm going to run the ramp down here and I'm going to continue the base out to pretty much the end of the ramp. So it's going to look kind of interesting. I hope you guys enjoy it once you've seen it. So uh, we'll catch up with you guys here in a minute once we've completed this little wall structure that we're forming here right now. So we'll see you guys here in a minute. Oh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, 
we go. So there's that. So I should have my pseudo building filled. So then I can tear out my walls. To get in underneath. One, two, three, four. And now I can just do that one there. And do that one there. And then this section should fall out. And there we go. So there's one wall done for my dino gate. Wall for that one. Wall for that one. One. That's two. Three and four for our dino gates. And we'll just do one across. That should tumble down. And there we go. And everything should hold up perfectly. And then we can uh, make this thing look fantastic. So this could be our ramp coming down uh, for our main room. Uh, for those of you who just trying to jumped in, I just saw someone. So we need to place, I don't want to place anything yet. Uh, we haven't decided how we're going to run that yet. So I just do want to get a couple of these up so they can kind of see the idea. Uh, I definitely need a couple more of those though. Uh, that's 403. that looks. I don't even need a ramp on this one. I'm going to, but we don't need it. It's beautiful. I don't know if I want to put a ramp on here. It's such a small jump. just wonder if it can actually work. Can find it here real quick, actually. Hold on. Let's do it this way. Oh, that's not working. Oh, this going to be fantastic! <sighs> so excited. All right, so there's that. So then let's get our dino gates ready. I need to get my ramps out. Oh, this is gonna be a really cool base. Really cool base. All right, let's get to my dino gates. I need what, dino gates and ramps. So, metal dino gates are... Oh, don't freeze. Little ramps are in 177. I should get a bunch of those in. Uh, we'll grab 50 of them. Most then, 265 and 266. See, I don't really want to put it there because it looks like it'd be goofy. Let's try that. Let's see what that lift looks like. Look at these ramps down here then. So we're going to tear those babies up, we'll wall off that structure then.
Alright guys, welcome back. So we're going to go ahead and finish this out. As I said, we've kind of got all these things up here. You guys can see what this thing's going to turn out like. This ramp is going to be really, really cool. I'm really excited for it. So you guys can see, the ramp looks great. I tested it. I walked up. It works great. We're still trying to decide how we're going to finish out this whole back section over here. So I don't want to fully close this off yet. So we're going to leave it open. But I did tear out our little buildings. I got our ramps down and everything. Uh, we just got to close up a couple more sections here. If we can get these to place in here. I don't think we can though. Nope, they aren't going to place. So they won't place there. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and snap in our little foundations for our uh, doors. So I like to do them from the inside uh, so they snap the right way. So six, place one there, place one there. We'll do seven, put our doors down, and holy smokes, guys. We've got our entrance to the volcano cave. Yes, because you can't really get big dinos in there anyhow. So I really don't have to worry about it too much. So let's go ahead and snap in our ramps over here meant to do that and if I can get one down I doubt I can I highly doubt it yep that's that's, that's one doubt two doubt all right so there's that guys um, I think it turns out really cool you guys can see I'm gonna run these walls all the way across um, they're gonna run all the way up all the way around the side of the base as I said I don't know what section we're at yet but that's gonna be an entrance to the base so you guys can kind of see how it's gonna look and this ramps gonna run the whole way down all the way down to where it's down here uh, I don't know how it's going to end up. Um, I'll probably have to end it with ramps. It probably won't be able to be slope dudes the whole way. But I think it's going to look really cool. And I think it's going to be kind of a cool base looking. So we're going to go here. We're going to build that. Obviously, we're going to build a big structure. I'm going to have the behemoth gate in the back to park some big dinos fabricating and stuff up front. So where it is, guys, uh, that's going to be it for this episode. You guys are seeing the first half of this base being built. I think it's going to end up being really really cool looking it's going to have a really cool ramp coming down uh, obviously we're going to have some flyer pens and stuff so we'll see you guys here on the next episode everyone if you haven't been here before go ahead and subscribe or like to the channel if you guys want to see anything or have any cool ideas for me to add to this space let me know um, and just go ahead and drop a uh, comment down in the uh, description down below so we'll see you guys on the next episode i hope everyone enjoys it everyone have a great day For everyone that is on the stream right now, I'm going to go ahead and sign off, guys. Um, I was just finishing up the episode for the highlight reel for what we're doing. Uh, we're going to go ahead and finish up. It's been a couple hours. Uh, so I will catch you guys on the next episode or on the next stream. I will be streaming again tomorrow night. Uh, we're going to continue working on this build. It's going to be a lot more pillars and stuff and finishing the ramp and all that kind of fun stuff. So I hope it's going to turn out really cool. It's going to be a, a very large building. Uh, we're going to do some funner stuff with like the walls and stuff up here. So we'll see you guys uh, later. Uh, thank you for watching, and uh, everyone have a great day.